Well, okay everybody, after five hours. Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Planet Zoo and Pine Brook Sanctuary. I hope you're all doing well. We are back with our otters and they are looking very cute. Look at them just running around the habitat. In this episode, we're making quite a lot of money now. So I am thinking it is about time that we sort out our main entrance to our zoo. We're gonna have another entrance there and we're also gonna try and incorporate something for this. So we'll see how it goes. And um, I'll see you shortly.
Okay, everybody, after five hours, we have got two entrances. So, yes, okay, thinking about it, two entrances was a bit excessive, but I think it turned out okay. So, let me show you how it went. The original plan I had just, it just didn't work or it just didn't go to plan. So, what we have is, I did figure out that you could delete the front of the original entrance. That's what we did. You can exit through here, so you just see the Pinebrook Sanctuary as you leave in. But as you come in, you see the little welcome signs. And then to the left and to the right is just a little bit of a garden with some glass window panes looking outwards. So you come through here and you can see the Pine Brook Sanctuary sign along with two huge planters that the guests just walk straight through <laughs> and um, they are uh, covering the pillars that are supporting the big bridge. To the left we have the toilets and um, just some little plants and things like that. Now I did originally have a walkway through here but I thought well if we're kind of being realistic which i'm not entirely sure whether we are anymore <laughs> um but you could just walk straight through now i know you can walk technically straight through anyway but we'll just have to trust the guests that they actually do buy tickets <laughs> now i have put a little information center over here but i probably will put in another one once we do create the shells for them I, this isn't probably going to be the standard shell that we go for but I just thought I would decorate that anyway seeing as we are here okay so you can come through this way and you get a good look at the tapirs and you can come around here have a little look at the exhibits you can go that way for our giant otters or you can come up here and ignore that little rock on the floor that is an ambient sound so can someone please remind me in the comments that that is there when we do our prop build <laughs> and you come up here over the walkway bridge over the two entrances and it's just going to rain i knew that was going to happen <laughs> yeah so it's not as i expected it to be to be honest i kind of wanted it to be more enclosed than this but having that enclosed and this as well i was worried it was going to start looking more like a castle than anything else um so we at the moment we do have just one walkway into the zoo but it's not a long walkway like we had in um, creative grasslands it's really short and the guests can go one of four ways if it does start getting really congested in this area then what we can do is we can go back to our original plan of putting it in the little walkway through here and hopefully that will help just a little bit I really like it. Please do let me know if you do too. I really hope you do. Thank you so much for watching and I will catch you in the next one. Thank you so much. Bye bye.